What's up my crazy subscriber? This is Joe King Johnson before and today we're gonna to be talking about Black Ops 3 campaign mode. So uh, some of the latest news and rumors here in Twitter has been that Von der Haar has 100% confirmed that Charlie's Intel.com uh, website has been on point. You know all their information, all their leaks about Black Ops 3 could be 100% true because Von der Haar talked to them, talked to them in Twitter. So damn, you know that's insane. You know, Fucking charlieintel.com might be like an inside worker or something in Treyarch. So, um, anyways, one of the articles that I read from that charlieintel.com website is that um, I, I read the one about campaign mode. And, man, I was really surprised what kind of features they had in campaign mode. Because now, they're going to be returning back the co-op mode in campaign mode. So, that's awesome. You know, it's been a very long time since I last played like two players in campaign mode, which was like in World at War. But wait, there's more, guys. Um, according to the information, there will be a four player co op in campaign mode. And another thing, there will be matchmaking. What the fuck? That is something I've never heard before in a freaking game of Call of Duty. In some other games, of course, yes, you know, there's like Left 4 Dead and some other fucking games where you can play like four player co op in campaign mode. So that's why I'm not, I'm not saying like it's the first game ever. Like, so you guys can kind of get me. So, anyways. First game ever in the Call of Duty series to have a four-player co-op and matchmaking. That's super insane. It looks like they're actually putting effort into campaign mode. It's not like Call of Duty Goals or Call of Duty Advanced Warfare where the campaign mode only lasts like four hours. No. Now they have co-op and matchmaking and for sure the story is going to be more insane. And uh, I can't wait to play it. After watching all the Snapchats and all the trailers, uh, like the Ember one and the original one that just released like a week ago or two weeks. Um, after watching those trailers... I'm like more pumped up to play the campaign mode. Like I'm not lying here. I'm like actually more into this the story mode. Like what's going on with this company making humans into robots and shit, making organs or, or organs, you know, into machine parts and you know making people live longer than they expected. And people want to overthrow that company now because they feel like they were playing God. And I want to see like what's up because it sounds so similar to another story that I have played before. If you guys have played Resident Evil, yeah. It sounds super similar to the Umbrella Corporation. It really does. So um, that got my attention and I really want to play it. So maybe like right off the first week, I'll be playing like the story mode with some random ass people. I try to see if I can like record it right away because I really want to see what it's all about. Because if all the Snapchats, you know, there's like what, like a doctor having surgery on some random ass person and some of the patients actually died or went crazy. And, you know, it's a lot of things that went down, man. So. Campaign mode is going to be insane. Four player co op with matchmaking. Online, by the way, I forgot to mention online. It's not just going to be like locally, it's going to be online. So uh, that's insane. Hopefully, it's not like 100% online because I'm pretty sure some of the people that are like into story mode but they want to play alone. Hopefully, there is like a, an option where you can play it by yourself and nobody interferes and shit. So. Cause I know there's certain people that feel like that way, like, oh, story mode should be like, like with single player, blah blah blah. You know, we all have our opinions and shit. Cause I remember back in Resident Evil Six or Resident Evil Five, that people actually wanted co-op, and then half of them didn't want a co-op. Like, it was a 50-50 split. So, um, so yeah, I mean, everybody has their opinion, and my opinion is that this is good. You know, this is super good, especially on a Call of Duty game. So, um, yeah, it's gonna be awesome. I can't wait to play. If you guys want to play with me in Black Ops 3 campaign mode, well, just add me during that time. You know, Black Ops 3, I'll be on it like 100% of the time. Try to figure out the best weapons, best maps. You know, trying to, trying to figure out secrets, my best gameplays. You know, everything's going to go down, man. I can't wait for Black Ops 3 right now for the campaign mode, though. The multiplayer is kind of letting me down already. But uh, I'm kind of like changing my mind already because um, I really want to give out like an actual reaction and, and you know, thoughts. Because my first time was kind of a... You know aggressive and i'm not taking my words back though like but like i really want to make another one so there, there might be another one but this time it's gonna be a vlog so um so yeah it's gonna be different hopefully so anyways that's enough for now guys the campaign mode information is out that it's gonna be four player co-op online matchmaking and hopefully it's long though i don't want it to be like freaking three hours long you know three fucking hours not make it like at least like around eight hours or so that would be decent that is fucking decent for a co-op player gameplay like that how long was Left 4 Dead? Le Left 4 Dead, anyways. I believe it was like six hours, right? If it's not, you guys can comment in the comment section and tell me how long it was. So that's not a super wrong. <laughs> Don't be thinking all perverted people. So, anyways, yeah, co-op 
campaign awesome snapchats trailers they will all convince you for campaign Vonda Card does really know how to make trailers I don't know how much money they spent on it but you know it's awesome so that is said and by the way the weapon that I was using in this gameplay was called the Ameli LMG and um, I already talked about this before so I'll be doing a best class setup pretty soon so that is it subscribe for more if you guys want to see more Black Aster news and rumors